Please use the following steps to configure your ATM software with the FXCM Trading Station. First, open your ATM software and log in. Next, open your FXCM Trading Station. Enter your password. This will bring you to your default dealing window. Minimize this window so that both the ATM software window and the dealing station can be seen on the same screen. This can be done side by side or top to bottom, whichever you prefer. Next, you can see from the software in the event box that we will be trading the pound dollar. To avoid all confusion, you may want to remove the excess currencies from the dealing rates box. This is done by right-clicking within the box, selecting Currency Subscription List, going to the currency, which we will not be trading, double-clicking Enabled, and scrolling down to Disabled. Once again, select the currency, double-click Enabled, down to Disabled. We will leave the pound dollar, since that is the currency we will be trading. Click Apply and you will notice on the left that the pound dollar is the only dealing rate now in the dealing rates box. Click OK to close that window. To open up a market order box you can click on either the buy side to open a buy market order box or the sell side to open a sell market order box. Once a market order box is open you can change it from a sell to a buy or a buy to a sell by clicking the appropriate button. First we will configure a buy. Next you will decide how much you want to place on the trade and the amount of your account. Since this would be a beginning trade you may want to stick near the lower half. If you are a more experienced trader, then you will understand exactly where to put your amount. Next, we will set our slippage. Since news trading creates a fast moving market, brokers are not always able to fill us at the price that we click, which leaves one of two options, a new price or not getting filled. FXCM allows on their platform to set a slippage control where if you place your slippage at 5 you will get in you will try to be filled within 5 points of the rate you clicked. If the rate changes and is 6 points away from the rate that you originally clicked you will not get filled. We recommend setting this to somewhere around 10 we have found that this offers a good chance of execution at a good rate and keeps you out of a bad fill. With this market order box up, we can now configure the ATM software with the FXCM trading station. This is done by clicking the Configure Clicks button which brings up the click configuration window. We will be configuring a safe buy so we double check that first the safe buy button is checked. To enter a trade with a buy box open all we will need to do is the first mouse click you click record mouse click the field will turn red for record. We drag our mouse above the OK and do not click with the mouse above the OK hovering we press the C button to capture that location. You will notice on the right under mouse click 1 
the first mouse click will click on the OK button. This will enter a, a buy and that is all we had to do to enter in a buy from this position in our platform. Next, to configure a cell, we click Safe Cell. You will notice that the mouse click one box becomes empty, seeing that it is a new set of parameters we will need to start over. First, we will click Record Mouse Click on the mouse click one and if this were a cell we would want to make sure that this is changed from a cell from a buy box to a cell box this is done by hovering above the cell and pressing C that will capture the location and first click this button to make it a cell box from there we can go to mouse click 2 click record mouse click field turns red for record and hover above the OK button but do not click it. Press C once again for capture and that location is captured. So if our safe cell requirements are met this buy orders box will first be clicked above the cell button which will change it to a cell orders box and then be clicked OK to enter into the market as a cell. With the safe buy you will notice it's still recorded since it is already a buy box, all that is need to take place is the clicking of OK to submit the order. Since those are all configured, we can now click Save and Close. All that is left to do is click the On button so that the clicks will be enabled and take place if the correct requirements are met on the software. Now we wait for the announcement. When the announcement comes out, and let's say it has a deviation of 2, of plus 2, which will meet our trigger for a safe buy, you will notice that the software will click the OK button on your market order and enter it into a buy. And there we are, in a buy. And that is all for configuring the FXCM trading station with the ATM.